she was so adamant that I come off the dating app and I did it. And when this whole thing blew up, I went just to check and see if she was still on it and she was. So this is Riley. And he's a part of the new season of Before the 90 Days, season six. So he's matched up with a woman called Violet, okay? And um, he's come off dating, dating apps because of what she said. But then she has stayed on the apps. But yet this guy is still going to do what? He's still going to pursue a relationship with her? I mean, listen. I, I, she didn't delete it? So what did she say about the fact that you saw her still on an app? She probably she said, said, why were you looking, right? Because you were supposed to be off that. But anyway, what did she say? She That's did what she say said? That. See that? You know what? You know when a woman knows a woman? When a woman knows a woman, <laughs> I bet she said he shouldn't have been having a look in the first place. And you know what's so crazy? The smirk in his face. Is that, uh, yeah, that happened. That's the game. That is the game, man. After I found out that Violet was still on a dating app, we had a really rough patch. Just arguing a lot. But despite the arguing, the rough patch, you are still planning on going and seeing this woman and... <laughs> and even though we did resolve these things, there's still that little bit in me that I'm just not sure I believe her. But at the end of the day, I put that all aside. Only a fool would put all of that aside. I chalk it up to miscommunication or cultural misunderstandings. Ah, the good old American excuse. Something that I see with a lot of Americans on this show. They always say, well, I think it was just a culture clash, you know? There was obviously some sort of culture thing that, you know, we're, 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 we just wasn't understanding each other properly. So that's what went wrong. Not the fact that it has nothing to do with culture, it's the fact that you're being played. This woman even lied to him about a divorce. She told him that he was divorced. She told him that she was divorced. And then when he finally came for she was like, oh yeah, I'm divorced now. But the whole time she said, so she said she was divorced while she was going through the divorce process. And then he says, oh, I'm divorced now. So why didn't you say that I'm going to be divorced rather than saying that I am divorced? You know what I'm saying? She, like, she likes to lie. If there's no cultural differences in people that lie, if somebody lies, they lie. I, I know you guys love me and you have concerns. She's worth it. But I really believe that she can be the one. Well, to be honest with you, Riley, bro, I would like to sit and say to you, I really wish that she is going to be the one for you. I really want to sit and say to you that I feel like she could be the future. And she's really going to be that woman that's going to finally make you say those words that he does not want to say. He has this thing where he will not tell a woman that he loves them. Reason being is because whenever he has told a woman that he loves them, they end up always running away. So right now he's got this role in place of him not saying that. But planning on going to see her and he's planning on proposing to her. Proposing to her. Hey, man, it wouldn't be night day fiance without some calamity, right? Wait, the way old number. Did I say some? No, without calamity for the whole freaking season. But hey, this is Riley. His woman is Violet. And you know what? Huh. When shit hits the fad, it's going to be interesting. You guys let me know what you're thinking down below in the comments. Don't forget to like, sub, and of course, peace.